Hello, the Bible teacher Susan Grant here with another Minute Morning Devotion. Minute number 1251, entitled Bodybuilding Rejoice Always. Now that I live in very rural America, I don't see police state trooper cars as often as I did when I lived in other places. Even so, when I see a police vehicle, I always look at how fast I'm going and have often whispered, no, please no, because I knew I was speeding and deserved a ticket. When this happens and I'm not pulled over, the feeling of relief is as close as I can understand grace. I deserve to be ticketed, but I was not. In 1 Thessalonians 5.16, Paul tells us to rejoice always. This word for rejoice can be translated into delighting in God's grace. What would my life be like if I could just sit back feeling the blessings of grace? There would be no judgment from myself at the moment, only the waves of love washing over me because God forgives. The feeling of freedom from self-imposed condemnation would be such a relief. This is what Paul means by rejoicing always. Isn't God's grace amazing? Just a final note to readers who have a mind like mine. With extending such grace, wouldn't people take advantage of it? I'm sure many do, but God's grace is not in proportion to our capacity for gratitude or repentance. It just is. What a lot to rejoice over. Have a gracious day.